Hello, my name is John Gillespie. This is a small video tour of the Cloister Studio. We're starting in the booth. Um, various small diaphragm condenser microphones. Uh, SE Electronics 4400. Uh, stereo Pair. SE Voodoo VR Ribbon Mic. Blue Hummingbird Mic. Um, SM81 from Shure. Encore 100i. I have three of those. Really great tom mics and snare drum mics. Um, Rode Stereo Small Diaphragm Condenser. Uh, Mojave M50. Blue Kiwi. Um, Blue Bottle Rocket Stage 2. Several more small diaphragm condenser microphones. And uh, there's my window into the control room. AKG D112 kick drum mic. Um, and moving into the control room. Um, we start with a Balinese gong and uh, an Epiphone banjo and my four-year-old daughter and my CD collection. Uh, Merlin by Seagull. Yamaha classical guitar. Um, I also didn't mention there's a classical guitar and an Alvarez Dreadnought in the booth. Uh, Fender ukulele. Um, Epiphone uh, Dot 335. Moog Mini, Chord Chaosolator Pro. Eventide H9. My controller keyboard from Studio Logic. It's a Fatar keybed. Fully weighted wooden keyboard. Uh, Korg R3. Really, really nice uh, vocoder in there. My 1964 Harmony bass. Bunch of wind chimes. Uh, Squire fretless uh, jazz bass. Uh, PRS Orianthi model. Uh, Ibanez Sound Gear 5 string bass. Fender Dobro. Wechter Nashville Strung, high strung guitar, Epiphone Les Paul Standard. Um, the console is a Midas Venice 32, uh, Mackie HR824 speakers, and an M Audio sub. Uh, my Mac Pro. And then comes my rack um, OCX HD clock. Uh, running an Apogee Symphony uh, I.O. with 16 in, and that also is controlling an Apogee DA16X uh, output module uh, into a dangerous 2-bus LT summing mixer. There's my 500 series rack, which is uh, a Neve 511, Lindell... Um, a preamp and compressor, DBX compressor, Elysium, Elysia M presser, Little Labs Voice of God, uh, DBX DSer, Eventide uh, DDL 500 delay, uh, DBX subharmonic synth, and the um, Aphex Big Bottom. Below that we have the uh, uh, Mic Tech. MPA 201 stereo mic pre and the warm audio WA 76 compressor uh, that's the HP 60 headphone amp um, over here we have a blue Robbie mic pre and a Neve 5043 uh, dual channel compressor then the WA 2A uh, warm audio leveling amplifier, um, Digitech uh, reverb unit that allows me to uh, put reverb in the headphones and such, monster power unit. Here is um, some pedals I use, uh, bass sans amp, uh, and then the Echolution pedal from Pigtronics, also the Quantum Time Modulator which is uh, a really great chorus pedal. 
Below that, we have, of course, the Funk Logic Palindrometer. Awesome little piece. Um, up here, we have the Avid 11 Rack guitar rig. Below that, Antelope MP8D 8 channels of premium mic pre. And then my patch bay to uh, hook all into it. Right now I have set up for a rock and bass session, which is happening pretty soon. Um, and below that, some actual tape decks. Cassette analog, uh, DAT, and ADAT tapes. So, that's the brief tour of uh, the Cloister Studio. I also forgot to mention that I have a massive amount of uh, various percussion instruments in the booth. Uh, Anklung, a weasel that my great-grandfather stuffed. A um, bunch of instruments from Bali. Various drums, shakers, percussion instruments, including bottles and Pringles cans and uh, handbells and all kinds of drums. So uh, there's that Dreadnought guitar and a classical guitar that I bought uh, from a friend in, I think, 1978 for $20. So um, that concludes the brief tour of the Cloister Studio. Thanks for checking it out.